So we did the in-flight report last night. That was pretty awesome. Uh, finally got to announce Keyforge, uh, which is a game we've been working on for a couple years. Keyforge is a essentially a new creates a new genre of games, which is something we're calling a unique game. So it's a competitive card game that everybody understands. Uh, but when you buy Keyforge, you're getting a single deck in one pack for ten dollars, and that deck is unique. And that means literally it's unique. No one else in the world has the deck that you have. They all have unique names, unique card backs. It's super cool. Hi, I'm Brad Andres, and I'm here on the floor of Gen Con. We've been working on this game for the last two years. I'm so excited to finally have it be played. Uh, seeing everyone kind of just going to town on all the cards that we've worked so hard on, it's, it's amazing. Please, if you get a chance, come down, get a demo in, you won't regret it. Hello and welcome from Gen Con 2018. My name is Evan Johnson and I'm super excited about the Mother of Dragons expansion that we just announced for Game of Thrones, a board game. This is an expansion that really revolutionizes the way that you play the game. It introduces two new factions, House Targaryen and House Aaron, and expands the total player count up to eight players. You can play these massive sprawling games that you're battling for control of Westeros. Along with House Targaryen, as you might expect, you get a whole Esso sideboard with new regions to conquer. It includes the Iron Bank of Braavos, where you can take out loans if you're willing to pay their heavy debts, right? And it also includes Dragon Meeples, which can fly around and burn your opponents. So it's pretty sweet, and I'm extremely excited to see it. So excited that we just announced Arkham Horror 3rd Edition. This edition takes one of our favorite games of all time, adds lots of fun new things. For example, there's a modular game board that really lets you see the locations that you're going to. But what I'm most excited about is the way that this game can tell stories. Each of the ancient ones you play against, they've got their own scenario with events that are going to be coming out stories that can branch in wildly different directions depending upon the choices that you make. If you're a fan of our Lovecraftian games and you want to see the heart of where it all began and where it's going, you need to check this out. Hi, this is Frank Brooks, designer of X-Wing 2nd Edition. Here we are at Gen Con 2018. In second edition, players are really excited about us getting to refocus on the fundamentals of flying the ships, uh, our ability for us to change the squad point costs for cards to keep the game competitively balanced, and uh, just in general all of the tiny little quality of life improvements that we've been able to add through being able to tweak all of the cards and the rules ever so slightly. X-Wing has already seen a limited release here at Gen Con, but look forward to it on a wider release in September. Actually, we have a bunch of other things that we're demoing uh, that we announced in the lead up to the show. We have Heroes of Tiranoth, uh, we have the new edition of Cosmic Encounter, um, we're continuing to demo Legion and Star Wars Destiny, Legend of the Five Rings, we have a ton of stuff. So if you didn't get the Gen Con this year, please make sure you come next year, check out our booth, check out our stuff. Hope to see you.